And now, The View from Washington, an explanation of U.S. policy. Multilateral nuclear negotiations between the P5 plus 1 countries and Iran, led by the EU, will resume January 18th. The parties are working toward completing a comprehensive accord concerning Iran's nuclear program, after agreeing last November to extend the deadline to the end of June. As he articulated last year at the United Nations, President Barack Obama has been clear and consistent in his message to Iran's leaders and people about the need for a diplomatic resolution to the issues raised by the Iranian nuclear program. Do not let this opportunity pass. We can reach a solution that meets your energy needs while assuring the world that your program is peaceful. President Obama has expressed the hope that a resolution to the nuclear issue would lead to the reintegration of Iran into the international community and could serve as the basis for improved relations between the United States and Iran. Iran's leaders have a way now to break through the isolation their country is experiencing, Mr. Obama said, and they should seize it. Because if they do, there's incredible talent and resources and sophistication inside of Iran, said President Obama. And it would be a very successful regional power that was also abiding by international norms and international rules. And that would be good for everybody. That would be good for the United States. That would be good for the region. And most of all, he emphasized, it would be good for the Iranian people. That was The View from Washington, an explanation of U.S. policy.